hello lovely people welcome to the focus on fragrance channel i hope you're all doing very well and smelling great today i'm gonna be doing this fragrance review and before i tell you guys how much this is similar to nui the ec from ec miyake and the one from dolce and gabbana before i tell you guys let me first tell you about this fragrance so this is the perfumer's choice jean mary number no. three from the house of milton lloyd england uh, i know the name is quite long and not a lot of people get the names of these but what can we do so this is the box this is the 83 ml and the box looks like this on the top this says uh, six hours guaranteed long lasting and on the bottom you get a barcode on the front here it says perfumer choice number three chosen chosen by jean mary master perfumer and a lot of information over here which can't be really seen because it is written in the same color so let's take it out guys this is a card type uh, wrapped around it we'll put that to the side oh my god okay <clears throat> so this is the solid box and let's take it out I have already opened this so just to show you guys this is the sticker on the bottom solid box like this nothing much so the bottom 83 ml in the front it says perfumer choice chosen by Jean Mary master perfumer number three a pretty simple cap decent with a drop of logo all the drops here here and over there okay so the sprayer guys let me show you if you put your finger on this it will continue to spray but if you just want a small spray just do like this so this is an aerosol type of sprayer present on all of the Milton Lloyds Oh my god this is so strong i have not even sniffed it up close and from there i can smell it it's going into my nostrils wow a cardamom blast guys if you love cardamom do get this for yourself so let me do a notes breakdown for you guys in the top we have the incense with grapefruit and coriander in the middle notes we have the black pepper with cardamom and nutmeg in the base notes we have vetiver and patchouli with amber so these are the official notes guys <clears throat> and in my opinion guys this is a very very good fragrance it is has this sparkling fresh citruses from the grapefruit it does have this incense but it is very well mixed with the coriander and grapefruit you cannot it is not at all that dark and head aching type of uh, incense it is a very soft very calming incense and I could definitely get the nutmeg and cardamom the cardamom is the main player in this all the way cardamom from top to the dry down in the base I can get the patchouli and whatever so basically guys this is a very fresh spicy warm spicy aromatic a smoky woody type of fragrance you can think like if you apply this you're gonna be like going to the spice market and every type of spice is present there soft spicy fresh spicy that type of a fragrance so this is like a, if you can say like you put some smoky you uh, take some smoke put that in a can add some cardamoms whatever patchouli and voila you have created this fragrance this is a it reminds me of dirt but in a very good way if you like the smell of dirt definitely get this so <clears throat> for the season guys i would say this is a very winter type of fragrance because of the incense and this 
dirty dirt type of a earthy fragrance very smoky very woody so definitely for the winter and fall time in the daytime especially you can wear it at night and this is very masculine very masculine i would say plus 25 to 30 not for the teenage guys because this is a bit mature like uh, for a very sophisticated man and this is a very sophisticated fragrance for like a rich businessman type of a guy and <clears throat> this is like it's very really common guys if you like cardamom nutmeg the dirt type of a note this is for you the best fragrance for you guys and if you do a fair rating for this guys i had to delete my video especially for only one thing because of the longevity on this is beast and i did not really check the longevity i made a video but i had to delete it now for the longevity i give this a 9 out of 10 guys because this stays on your skin for 3 to 4 hours but on your clothes it stays for the whole day guys if you smell this after 24 hours of applying on your skin on your clothes sorry you will get that whatever that patchouli the cardamom this dirty earthy type of a fragrance still present on your clothes so a 9 out of 10 for the longevity for the edge guys a uh, 6 out of 10 a little weak on the edge but projection is better than the edge a 7 out of 10 for the projection for the price tag a 10 out of 10 you can never beat the milton lloyd this is the 83 ml which is uh, ranging from 15 dollars to 20 dollars and the uh, 50 ml bottles which looks like these you can find them for five to ten dollars depending especially on your location and for the scent overall guys i would give it an eight out of ten because lovely scent for the bottle a six out of ten simple bottles like all in the end we do a comparison guys so this is not at all like the d and g uh, the one a uh, very little 10 percent like the one from dolce and gabbana but this is mostly going to be similar to 40 percent to nui di isi from isi miyake this does not have the tonka bean and ber uh, bergamot and leather knot but still this is very much similar like nui di isi from isi miyake and this also reminds me of bulgari men in black the orient if you have tried any of those fragrances this is definitely for you check it out recommended for the winter times or if you like the mention notes so this was all for the video if you like the video hit that like and subscribe button you can reach me out through my instagram until the next video guys take care bye bye